All right, welcome everyone. I'm Jean Wallerman, the Senior Services Manager here at the Oshkosh Senior Center. I want to welcome uh, Senator Fyan, who is here with us today, City Manager Mark Roloff, uh, Ray Mauer, the Parks Director, Judy Brewer, the President of the Friends of the Oshkosh Senior Center. Welcome to the Oshkosh Senior Center. So just a little brief history of our Connect Through Tech program started about two and a half years ago when we definitely saw the need after the COVID virus hit, how seniors needed technology more so in their lives ever, than ever before. So currently right now we have been operating that program for two and a half years plus and with a variety of one-on-one -on -one tech training with senior issues with technology as also with large group educational programming through technology. So that's a little bit of a brief history of our Connect Through Tech program. So right now I'd like to welcome Mark Roloff, city manager, to come on up and say a few words. Thank you, Jean, and good morning, everybody. Uh, I'm really excited uh, with uh, this announcement today, um, partially because uh, as a senior myself now, uh, I think that the providing access uh, to technology uh, knowledge uh, is something that's very important for our senior population. And I also believe that uh, the generosity of uh, businesses such as AT&T uh, is just wonderful that they've uh, created a program that is almost a perfect marriage. And if I had any role here, it was really, I kind of played the role of matchmaker. Uh, uh, when Robin Gruner from AT&T informed me about this, I was like, this is, this is exactly what our t uh, Tech Connect program was all about. And, uh, and after that, we identified uh, our friends of the Senior Center that were the appropriate recipient for that. So I am just excited that um, we were able to connect uh, two groups that have something in common, that they wanted to help seniors, help our community, and use it through technology. Um, the Senior Center is a centerpiece for uh, services to our senior community uh, throughout Oshkosh and throughout this area. And that is so vital to keeping our senior citizens independent as much and as long as possible so that they can enjoy uh, their life in their own homes uh, and be better connected through to their family, to services, to socialization. All of those things that um, the Senior Center here in Oshkosh has been so uh, known for. Uh, and adding that technology element, I think, has helped improve the independence of our senior population. So I want to thank the staff of the Senior Center and thank AT&T for all they're doing uh, throughout the state as well as right here in Oshkosh, Wisconsin. So um, thanks again to everybody involved uh, in this announcement today. And uh, with that, I'll turn it over to, to Ann. It's my turn. It's your turn. Oh, lucky me. So I'm going to actually introduce Kathy Keats, if you want to come up here. So the most important part about Connect Through Tech is the outcomes that uh, the seniors receive. And Kathy and I talk pretty often. She attends quite a few of our Connect Through Tech classes, and I was sharing with her that this grant will allow us to bring in some speakers on some topics um, that she may um, be interested in. And so we're already brainstorming who we're gonna bring in. So Kathy, just share with them a couple words on you know, why the Connect Through Tech program has been great for you. I feel it's been great for me because I have had issues with my cell phone trying to get things to work. And the individuals that work with that program really help you. They take their time. They listen to what you need. And even the video taping and everything, I have found all these programs very interesting, especially with all the scams going on and what you can do about it. And I have learned a lot. 
I really appreciate the Senior Center for having these programs. Thanks. I appreciate it. So we want to thank AT&T for this funding. Um, just to give you the funding story of the Senior Center, we are so grateful to the city for funding 50% of our operating budget, but the rest we get in grants, fees, donations. So it's really important that, AT that we receive this money from AT&T, helps us extend, extend or expand the program, um, and we couldn't be happier with this. And I just want to acknowledge the friends of the Oshkosh Senior Center. They have been partners of us since 1986, and they have been a big part of our fundraising efforts. So Robin, come on up. Well, thank you so much, Anne. I appreciate it. And thank you, everybody, for joining us today. What an incredible gem you have here in this community. I mean, the resources available to the seniors in this community is top notch. And I was so impressed the first time I came down here and took a tour. Um, so thank you again to uh, City Manager Mark Rolla for introducing me and Anne for working with me and Jean. Um, and your team on working with me through the grant process through the AT&T Foundation. I'm Robin Gruner, Director of External Affairs for AT&T Wisconsin, and I'm really happy to be here on behalf of the AT&T Foundation to support the Connect Through Tech program. Um, with this funding, um, we are looking to be able to expand the program and potentially bring in over 125 new uh, visitors to, to work within this program, and that's very, very exciting. Um, in 2021, you might not be aware of this, AT&T uh, made a three-year, $2 billion commitment to help bridge the digital divide. Following COVID, we saw the absolute necessity for getting people engaged with technology, getting people connected at all ages and stages of life for a variety of reasons. Um, we do this through things like investing in local programs like you see here at the Oshkosh Senior Center to support the seniors in getting educated and using technology. Uh, one of the things I wanted to mention also is as Mark mentioned earlier, research does show that seniors are among the demographic that's least likely to be online because of many different factors. Some of them are cost, some of them are access, some of them are quite frankly fear. So having the resources here to talk about and teach our seniors in our community um, how to utilize technology is a really fantastic resource because quite frankly, I think our seniors are the ones that need that connection the most. Um, so this is why we're here today. Very proud to be here on behalf of the AT&T Foundation uh, to help the Oshkosh Senior Center provide these resources to bridge the digital divide. And on behalf of our AT&T employees here in the state of Wisconsin, here in your community, I'm going to present a check. And Judy, do you want to come up to you and Jean? We'll have Judy and Jean and Ann uh, just come up for a quick presentation of the check. This is the one that doesn't go in the bank, but this is the one that's nice in pictures. On behalf of the AT&T Foundation, we're here to present $10,000 to the Oshkosh Senior Center. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, are you going to get a photo? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Perfect. Great. And I'll throw this right here and I'll turn it back over to you, Ann. Yeah, so I just want to thank everybody for coming, and we really appreciate it, and we hope you uh, continue to uh, support the Senior Center in the future, and we can't wait to see um, our fall speaker series that is presented by AT&T. Thanks. Thanks.